We have five academic partners, um, and these are Concordia University, University of Ontario Institute of Technology, McMaster University, Carleton University, and the University of California at Davis. Uh, we also have six uh, industry partners, and these are Microsoft Studios in Redmond, Washington, uh, Electronic Arts in California, their head office in California. We have Communitech, who's a aggregator and accelerator um, group in Kitchener-Waterloo in that region. From my standpoint, the biggest benefit we can bring to the partners is a stronger understanding uh, of how and why people play games. What we're going to bring to them is a stronger understanding of what that process is and how the kinds of engagements that do happen do in fact happen. But there's another side of this. Games companies tend to focus on engineering computer science initiatives. Where the arts come in typically is in um, graphics, animation, and those sorts of fine arts kinds of activities. What we want to bring to them is the understanding that games are about stories and about storytelling. And if you want the best storytellers, you have to turn to the people who understand stories. And that's where the humanities and the social sciences come into play in a really strong way. My goal is to help game companies truly understand that. Our research, in effect, would not be possible without the involvement of partners outside the, the academy. Uh, we need the games industries in order to drive our research, not so that we're providing research for them, although that's certainly part of our goal, but so that we know what the questions are. And people I've talked to at Electronic Arts and Microsoft are very interested in this. Microsoft has told us specifically this is sort of a project area they want to move forward on, right? And without the buy-in from industry into what we're trying to accomplish, um, this simply wouldn't be anywhere near as effective. In our case, because we were dealing with the games industry, which is a large industry, but remember it's larger than the movie industry, um, one of the things we wanted to do is take, take advantage of existing partnerships that we might have and then expanded into other companies that we really knew we wanted to work with. And what we did, we decided to, to focus on a group of about 10 companies and then narrow it down to five or six, whoever was willing to jump in at the time. And, it, and, and the, the trick there is really a matter of just continuing to ask them what they'd like to get of them in the context of what we know we can deliver. 